Warmer weather means that boats are getting back on the water, but on one of the most popular spots in Minnesota or the metro, they are making some changes. The five mile per hour speed limit on Lake Minnetonka now covers twice the area it did last summer. Our Kirsten Mitchell found out why and how some boaters feel about taking it slow. It's my first time out this year. Um, I'm going to catch some big ones. Enzo Moquist couldn't wait to get off the ice and on the water. Just being out in the sun with my friends and having a good time. But this year, boaters on Lake Minnetonka will have to take it slow. We're going two and a half miles an hour. They'll have to stay five miles per hour or less within 300 feet of the shoreline. That's twice as far as the previous requirement. That 150 foot rule is still in effect. Um, for watercraft traveling off of docks or other boats out in the lake or swimmers. The Lake Minnetonka Conservation District says the change came from concerns about large wakes created by boats. Really what it came down to was safety and how can we um, allow everybody to use the lake in the most safe and enjoyable manner. Last summer, John Bent told us he was worried about shoreline erosion. They uh, can move the uh, lake bottom in, in near shore locations, uh, which can disrupt uh, spawning beds for fish. Enzo will be one of the wake surfers riding a little further away from shore this summer. Having like jet skiers and parked boats around you and having to stay away from them might be a little bit of a struggle, but. I, think I can manage. It's a beautiful day. I hope everybody comes out. That's what Minnesota summers are all about is enjoying the lake. At Lake Minnetonka, Kirsten Mitchell, WCCO News. For some perspective, 300 feet is about the length of a football field. The Hennepin County Water Patrol will be out enforcing that new rule. A speeding ticket starts at $100.